in last lecture full form four full forms no five icbn icbn icnb 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 and icnb and icnb see are the full forms yes okay now the binomial nomenclature given by carolus linear and you know that carolus linear is known as father of exponential can you tell me that is the rules of the binomial nomenclature yes yes one by one tell me uh, in the biological Yes, so two names are there. First name is genus name, second is species name, and first letter is capital letter of the genus, and species in the all the letters are small. Good. Then, yes. Okay. No, no. Hey, under the name, who is it? गुड Now I can give the different names. That is indica. It is honey bee, and that's why the name is from apiculture. The cultivation 
of honey bee is known as apiculture according to the scientific name apiculture is given there so scientific name of honey bee is apis indica now second you know that mangifera indica mango third is rosa indica rose and fourth is maduka indica mahudo you know mahudo kijido asopalo kipal banyan tree tulsi this all are religious plants पहले तो मैं खबर है तो मार्केट में वो खीजड़ी या हनुमान का ये खीजड़ो छे एनी नजीक में ऐसे ही नाम खीजड़ी है हमने खीजड़ो पड़ी है हाँ so here I mean to say genus is different species is same in all different genus but same species Clear? Yes. Okay. Now I can write the few examples. Genus same. Species are different. Okay. Lion. Actually, it is given in your textbook in genus. It is given there in genus. Panthera leo, lion. Panthera tigris, tiger. Panthera pandas, leopard. <coughs> okay. Here, one group is there. Solenum nigrum. Peludi. Actually, Solenum nigrum is ornamental plant used for decorative purpose. But Solenum tuberosum potato, Solenum meson jena <coughs> brinjal, and then Pelium sepa onion. And Elium setaivum, known as garlic.
Here I can give you few examples only. Fine. So here we have to remember genus same. Fine. Species different. And here one family is there, Solanaceae family. Yes. Felidae. Canidae. Fine. So according to their different families are there. Now, another possibility. Here, genus different species may same. Here, genus same species different. Any other? Both are same. Scientist name, no. No. Popular name to bana bata hoi shakai de. But actually, some words misguide us. Some words misguide us. How? See. Starfish. Cuttlefish. They will fish, are not fish. Think about it. Some popular name can misguide us. Starfish, cuttlefish, they will fish, are not fish. These are totally different animals. Now, next point, species and genus, genus and species, both the names are same. Both the names are same. Fine? Let me tell you. But second name you play, please carefully write. There is no capital letter in the name. Species name is no capital name in the name. But that is not your. But then Mr. Kerry has said. You have writing matter in your name. No, Kerry is a valid word. Cutella, Cutella. 
popularly known as Katla. But what is this? Katla is fresh water edible fish. Actually, it is belonging to Postic tribes. Katla Rohu Mrigaru. I told you, if you remember, Katla Rohu Mrigaru, commonly known as Major Kai. These all are fresh water edible fish. Whereas, Milsa, Sardine, Mackerel, and Pomfret. These all are marine water edible fish. Yeah. So, Katala, Katala, edible fresh water fish. Then, Rattus, Rattus, Red. Okay. And Mouse. Red and Mouse both are different. Mouse or Mice. Mosca domestica. House plants. Red and mouse both are different. Actually, for laboratory experiment, mice are used there. And majority we form the transgenic mice. Transgenic means we, we alter the gene of the mice. Fine. Then here, Naja, Naja. Don't say this song. <laughs> King Cobra, the most poisonous name in the world. Come and dance up to it. Sarosh from the world. Sarosh from the world. And now listen. Totonyms are only applicable for animals, not for the plants. Okay? Total names are only applicable for animals, not for the plants.
Actually, we are belonging to Homo genus. We are belonging to genus Homo. Homo habilis and Homo erectus. Apri two species che. Main tamne wo lo table mein kyu tu na WhatsApp pa. Classification of the individual category wise. Homo need. Yaad kar. Homo habilis and Homo erectus. Away of the species testing heritage. Then, just uh, before 75,000 years, first men, first true men, found in Europe, known as Cro-Magnon men, and at that time. The scientific name of the man was Homo sapiens, and now the most intellectual organism on the earth. This is modern man, Homo sapiens sapiens. So this first Homo, actually Homo is only first genus, and first is sapiens is species, and second sapiens is subspecies. Right. Similarly, hibiscus. Can I jasud give it? Hibiscus, also known as jasud, can I China rose give it? The scientific name of the hibiscus is hibiscus rosa sinensis. Right? So, this is about trinomial nomenclature. M R genus, species, subspecies. But few limitations are there here. But majority we use the binomial nomenclature for all the organisms here. Now. Biological classification.
kinds of biological classification practical classification it is mostly on the basis of the economical importance fine <coughs> just for example oil yielding plants coconut groundnut soya bean like that then fiber yielding plant cotton jute jute ke kabhi na wo shorn hote hai shorn jute fine then medicinal plants ginger turmeric species plant sorry spices plants ginger turmeric coriander chili etc so on the base of the economical importance practical classification is there artificial classification can be given by linnaeus linnaeus classifies the plants according to the number of the stamens present in it and group of the stamen known as androsia so linnaeus gave the equal weightage to the reproductive and vegetative characters to the plant so you know that vegetative characters first habitat stem root leaves branches flower in that number of calyx type of a fusion free then corolla not a corolla corolla gynoecium androecium number of eggs united with each other or free from each other then type of the seed type of the fruit this all are known as vegetative characters and reproductive characters consider mostly the male and female reproductive organs type of the ovary present the number of the ovules in the ovary five seeds are found inside it huh? so all these are known as reproductive characters fine so linnaeus gave the equal weightage to the vegetative characters as well as reproductive characters of the plant and linnaeus classified the all the plants into 24 classes this is the most important one fine now the third is natural classification natural classification on the basis of complete or natural sorry gross morphology you know that morphology means study of external features it is the best classification used in nowadays Because most of the gross characters are now calculated here. Natural classification is of two types.
Natural classification is of two types. Natural formal, that is non phylogenetic, means no consideration of any type of the evolutionary changes. And natural phylogenetic, here we have to consider the all the evolutionary characteristics. Lemar proposed the term phylogenetic. Charles Darwin, known as father of evolution, he wrote one book. The name of his book, Origin of Species by Natural Selection. Now, just a one minute, carefully listen this information. What is natural selection? Each and every organism have to survive in atmosphere. Atmosphere is constantly changing. So each and every organism has to try to adapt to that atmosphere. And this is known as survival of fittest. Yes, the organism which live in the atmosphere adapt it and actively reproduce and form the fertile offsprings. The nature can select it to survive in the atmosphere. This is known as natural selection. The legit organism adaptation condition is actively fertile offspring form condition is NH nature. Atmosphere, whatever, what is selected? 
This is known as natural selection. And he wrote one book is known as Origin of Species by Means of Natural Selection. And the last sentence, phylogenetic classification is known as, also known as cladistic classification. Fine? So here I can stop now. See you in the next lecture.